this video, I'm going to show you how to take all the videos that you post on one social media platform and have them automatically repost to every single other social media platform. So for example, if you just post on TikTok, I'm going to show you how to automatically get those videos to automatically repost to other platforms like Instagram, YouTube, Snapchat, or even Pinterest. And it doesn't matter whether it's a video that you're going to post or if it's a video that you've already posted. Let's say you've already posted 200 TikToks. With this strategy, you can automatically repost all those TikToks to another social media platform and have them scheduled. Or let's say you've never posted on TikTok yet, but you don't want to deal with managing every single platform manually. Well, you could also use this tool to automatically repost your videos to those other platforms. And in case you're wondering if this works, I am very experienced with social media. I have over 200,000 followers on my main account on TikTok, Fly Juggler. But here's what's cool. All of my other social media platforms, which I pretty much never post to manually, have grown without me doing anything. My Instagram has over 350,000 followers. My Snapchat also has over 350,000 followers. My YouTube has over 85,000 followers. And even my Pinterest has grown. And again, I literally didn't touch this myself at all. So here's how you can automatically grow on all of these secondary platforms without you ever having to touch it. It's a tool called repurpose.io that basically does all of the automating for you. So I'll leave it in the first link in the description, but all you have to do is go to repurpose.io and you can create an account completely for free and start doing this literally without any money. So just create an account. I choose to just sign in with Google because it's easier. And then from here, you'll notice that there's a couple tabs on the top left. And really the first one that you really need to pay attention to is something called connections. This is where you're going to connect all of your different social media platforms to repurpose.io. So you can see here, I have Fly Juggler Snapchat, Fly Juggler TikTok. All of my different accounts are connected on repurpose.io in the connections page. So let's say your main platform was Pinterest. All you'd have to do is click add new connection here on the top right. You'd have to just click Pinterest, which is the thing you want to schedule it on. Name the connection. So if it was Fly Juggler, I would name it to whatever the name of my account is just so it's easy to keep track and then click connect. It'll then bring you to a page like this where you just have to authorize the app to let it automatically repost. And I would give access, but I've already done it with this account, so it won't let me. But basically just authorize access so that repurpose will be able to see all the videos in this account. And when you tell it to repost, it'll automatically repost it for you. So once you've connected all the accounts that you want to connect, so let's say I manually post a TikTok and I want to automatically repost to Instagram and YouTube, make sure to connect your TikTok, Instagram, and your YouTube in the connections page, and then you can move on to the next step. So now that you've connected all your accounts, the next step is to set up the actual workflow, which is the thing that causes the accounts to be connected and actually repost to each other. So we're just going to go on the top left here and click on workflows. And then from here, we're going to click create new workflow. So let's say we were trying to automatically repost our TikToks to our YouTube channel. Well, we would name it something that represented that. So I'd maybe name it fly juggler TikTok to YouTube, just so I know for myself what connection this is making between which platforms. Then I hit next as my source, I would select TikTok. And then the account that I connected would be the fly juggler TikTok. So I'd go with that one. Next, the action I want is for it to upload the video. So I'd make sure it says upload video, full video, and then click next. And then for my destination, I would just make sure to set it as fly juggler YouTube, post it to the main channel and post it as a short and then click done. From here, it'll bring you to this page. And this is very, very important. So you'll see that I have all these videos on my TikTok and they're not on YouTube currently. So let's say I wanted to schedule all of these old videos that I already posted on TikTok. Well, what I would do is I would click this button called auto publish and I would click this repurpose new and existing content. This means that instead of just automatically reposting all the new TikToks I post, it'll also automatically repost all of the old TikToks that I made. So I would click on this and let's say I wanted to make sure it didn't actually repost any of my new videos, just my old ones. When it asked me which content do I want to publish, I would just say existing content only or on a specific date. So then it would take all content posted before November 25th, 2024, which is today's date, and then start automatically reposting them in sequence from newest to oldest. So in other words, most recently uploaded to least recently uploaded. Once I'm happy with these settings, I would then set a publishing schedule. So I can choose what days of the week and between what time zones do I want this video to actually post. So maybe I'll click on every day a week because I just want to post once a day and it'll automatically post between 9 and 11 a.m. Or maybe I'd want to post three times a day. So then I'd make sure to add another time slot 
lot on every single day of the week. So Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. And now I'm posting three times a day automatically between these time zones randomly every single day. If I click enable auto publish, it'll do that. And as you'll see, it'll load for a second. And boom, there we go. Every single one of these posts now is auto scheduled to post without me literally doing anything. This is one of the most powerful softwares on earth because it lets you basically manage all these different social media platforms for you without you doing anything. Okay, but let's say you already posted all of these old videos and you don't really need to repost them anymore. You just need to repost your new videos that you upload to TikTok. You would then click auto publish and just make sure you click repurpose new content only and then click enable auto publish. This will make it so only new videos that you make will be automatically reposted. So that pretty much covers the basics. Again, if you want to use repurpose.io, I really recommend you check the first link in the description and it'll be completely free to start. But if that all makes sense to you, I do want to show you guys a couple more advanced settings that are pretty important with repurpose.io. So when I have this workflow scheduled between TikTok and YouTube, you're going to want to click on the settings button and see all the extra stuff that you can actually do. So the first thing you could do is customize the hashtags to be different on different platforms. Now, personally, I haven't found that hashtags affect my videos reach that much, so I don't really use them. But if you did, you could exclude videos that contain a certain hashtag. So let's say you posted a video on TikTok, but you didn't want it to get re-uploaded to YouTube. You could exclude the hashtag TikTok. And that way, if you posted a TikTok and had the hashtag, hashtag TikTok on that post, it wouldn't repost that video to YouTube. Or let's say you believe that there's some hashtags on TikTok that work better than ones on YouTube. You can remove the hashtags from TikTok and replace it with hashtags that you think do better on YouTube. So maybe hashtag shorts to indicate on YouTube that it's a YouTube short video. And most importantly here, you can set this to automatically trim to appear as a YouTube short. So currently the max amount of time you can upload a YouTube short is a three minute one. So if you post a three minute, one second video to YouTube, it will not be posted as a short. So let's say you recorded a TikTok and it's five minutes long, but you still want it to automatically repost to YouTube, but not as a long video, only as a short video. You can click this auto trim videos to appear as a YouTube short, and then it'll automatically trim the video at three minutes long. So it doesn't get posted as a YouTube long and it posts the first three minutes of that video that you posted on TikTok. And what's cool is you could select it to trim at three minutes or select it to trim at 60 seconds. So that's pretty nice. So yeah, that basically covers how to automatically repost your videos from one social media platform to another. And again, I've used this exact thing to grow my Instagram to over 350,000 followers, my Snapchat to over 350,000 and my YouTube to 80,000. All of this was automatic reposting that I literally didn't touch manually myself. So I really, really highly recommend you use repurpose.io. Again, it's free to start. You can try it out completely free no risk. And to make it easy for you guys, I left it as the first link in the description. So if you guys have any questions about repurpose.io or how it works or how to use it, make sure to leave a comment and I'll be happy to answer any of your questions on it. Thanks so much for watching and I'll catch you all in the next video. Peace.